Hello and welcome and today I'm going to talk to you about why you should play solo TTRPGs. I'll just get right into it. Number one, it is fun. One of the biggest complaints that I see about solo TTRPGs is that it would be boring. But to that, I say that they're only as boring as you make them. Perhaps a specific system may not be a good fit for your taste, but I firmly believe that there's a system out there for everyone. But with the right system, they only limit your imagination. So, if you think solo TTRPGs are boring, maybe you're the problem. Can we get on to number two? Number two is play on your own time. Only have 20 minutes? With solo play, that's not a problem. No scheduling times to play with other humans, and no last minute cancellations. Even if you did cancel, it's on yourself, so I don't think you'd care. You can play what you want when you want it. And on to number three, the versatility. Name any genre. Steampunk. Post-apocalyptic. That can be a solo TTRPG setting. You could play in Victorian England one day, the Wild West the next. And then the next, the next day find yourself in an interstellar sci-fi adventure. What kind of games can you play? Great question. You can play one-shots, campaigns, journaling, productivity games. The flavors of solo TTRPGs are truly too vast to list them all. So if you enjoy TTRPGs in general, there's a solo TTRPG out there for you. Thank you for watching, listening, however you consume your media. I appreciate it. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Don't forget to be nice people, and I'll see you in the next one.